The two times victim of an arsonist feels that she has been denied justice. The details in this report. Michelle's caught on a murder three said since an arsonist destroyed her home four months ago, he continues to walk free. Very unfair to me now that everybody in Jain with Scotland said that she lives at 647 Seafield Sapphire since 2000 and paid $3,000 for rent to one Narayan Kublal. She said that after some difficulties with Kublal, the housing ministry advised her not to pay any rent since Kublal is not the owner. The ministry then erected a sign stating that the land is its property. She said that Kublal burnt her house on August 21st, 2006. That matter was heard and dismissed in the court. Scotland repaired her home, but on September 20th last, she said Kubla burnt her house again. So now we burned down the place the 28th, com uh, completely break and enter for us, then born. How I know is him because when I get there, I met, met him fencing the wall, fencing the yard with some of the same material from the very same place. Him and his family. Today, an official of the housing ministry confirmed that the land does not belong to Kubla, nor is he authorized to charge rent. Today, two Kubla's wife who refused to appear on camera denied that her husband collected rent. She said that her husband was tried for a crime he knows nothing of. She said that the house was given to her sister-in-law some time ago and that her Barbados-based sister-in-law has the title for the land. The housing ministry maintained that the land is state-owned. Reporting for Prime News, Ivor Wharton.